Hi everyone! So in this video I want to talk about a really cool ZBrush plugin called Clean Tool Utility. You can download this plugin from the Pixologic website because it doesn't ship with the default version of ZBrush. So here I have just a quick unfinished sketch and now if I go to the Z plugin palette, of course I have already installed the plugin, there is this Clean Tool Utility. So basically this plugin will clean up your scene just by clicking a button. You can do delete morph targets, store morph target, bake the layers, delete the layers, texture off. You can do all of this bunch of operations just by clicking a button. If you click the button on the left side, this will do the operation for the eyeball icon active. If you click the button on the right side, this will do the operation for all of your subtools. So let's see an example. So, as you can see here on my subtools, I have just a quick mask, as you can see. So now if I go to the Z plugin, clean tool utility, and I search for the mask, so we, there is the clear mask. So you can do, of course, whatever you want. Just remember this for the eyeball icon active, this for all of the subtools you have. So just clicking the button. And now, as you can see, I have no mask anymore because we just by clicking a button ZBrush has deleted my masks for all of my subtools. So this is a really, really cool and quick way to clean up your scene. So to download this, uh, this plugin, it's very simple. So if you go to your browser, search for Pixologic, go to the Pixologic website, to the support, resources, ZBrush plugin, If you scroll down, because these, these plugins are shipped with the default version of ZBrush, now when you see this message, the plugins below, of, below this message are not included in the ZBrush installation by default. So just search for the Clean Tool Utility, and as you can see here, the Clean Tool Utility, just click the download button, and now we have to just unzip the file and copy the files in the ZBrush folder installation where they are, there are the other, uh, the other ZBrush plugin. So I hope, I hope you can find this helpful. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.